Hello my friends and welcome back to another TFT game. I am your buddy UC and we will be playing Pengu's Party today. And I think I'm going to pick Pot of Gold. Yeah, Pot of Gold. That sounds good. No, 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 no. Dude, why does this always get picked? Is there some sort of cheat code involved that just picks this every time that it's there? I don't want to go down to 40 HP. A belt. Ooh, Sharima, Mech Pilot, or Laser Core. I'm gonna take Mech Pilot, dude. What if I get a Mech Pilot, and then I go Heavenly? And then I do, like, a Heavenly Pilot Mech. That's a great idea, actually. I think that's what I'm gonna go for this game. Heroic Grab Bag. So I could get a... Two-star... I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it right now. I'm gonna just, uh, two-star Riven right away. Yep. I like that. And, uh... Then I guess I pick this up and this. And do like, I don't know, like attack speed or something. I think I'm gonna do attack speed, dude. I'm gonna do this. Let's see. Oh, dude, he's getting kind of destroyed. He's getting a little destroyed without any items. His ult seems kind of good. I've never used this uh, trait before, so this will be pretty interesting to see. This guy took shimmer scale, it looks like he's gonna econ. Very hardcore. Oh, dude, Riven! Go Riven! That was awesome of her. Um, I could do... Who did I sell? I sold uh, Jaina. That's fine. Ooh, I don't want any of this Story Weaver, though. I think I want to get, like, some Heavenly units in there. Well, this is the best I've got so far. It's really unfortunate that I don't have any good items to use, but... Sure is like that sometimes. There's nothing we can do about that. This guy looks pretty weak though, so maybe it'll be a free win here. Guess I could do like a bunch of bruisers. Treasure armory that can be. Oh, dude, give me a radiant item, dude. Give me a good radiant item. That's not a radiant item. That's not gonna work either. Nope. I need at least one really good item. Are you kidding me? That's crazy. I should have maybe taken the Hodge there. But I kind of like refused to take such a subpar item. <laughs> and now I have nothing. I'm still thinking like Heavenly is the way to go. Just like a bunch of Heavenly units and a really strong Garen. Right now all he's benef uh, benefiting from is just Bruiser. Two Bruiser. But what I need him to do is benefit from all of this stuff. Let me try to actually get an item for my Garen. Uh, sword would be good. Bow would be really good. That's actually what I need over anything else. It's just the bow. Come on, let me get that bow. Dude, he's gonna take it. Dude, come on, dude. There's nothing here that I could actually use. I'm gonna take Imperial. Let me go ahead and just slam this. I think trying to go for the three-star Riven would be the proper play here, depending on how many are gone. Let's just see one gone so far, two gone. A lot of people seem to be going Riven, which makes a lot of sense. Story Weaver's been like the best comp ever. Ah, uh, he's, he's really just going exactly what I'm going. That's kind of crazy. I have some items there, right? And my Garen's a lot bigger. He should be able to win. Dude, that was a battle. That ult just got like one person. Come on. You can do it. Yes, yes. She got a huge AoE there. Got all of them. Nice. I don't think we're going to stay too much the same thing, so it's not the worst. What else do we got? Nomsies and uh, Umbral. It kind of sucks that I got Imperial. I would have really preferred something that worked on my whole team. Rather than just two random units. And I, I do remember that Imperial trait though. That was a lot of fun back then. We'd be able to make some huge Swains. Some huge Samiras. Nice, dude. I think Heavenly is going to work really well with this build that I'm doing. Let me just go ahead and claim the three interest gold and then I'll level up 
and maybe roll down a little bit. I'm not sure yet. Okay, so that. You forgot to bow. And some extra HP. So this dude definitely don't need Bard. Roll down just a little bit. Some two-star units is it's pretty nice. Whoops, I okay, so I definitely think I take out Dude, my items are so bad though. These items are killing me right now. They're so bad. I'm like struggling really bad right now trying to salvage something. Dude, hopefully I get a heavenly spatula. That's really what I need over anything else. It's just a heavenly spatula. Oh man, I'm not running heavenly right now, so there's no chance. No chance, dude. I'm gonna do it. A fast level. I'll put... I'll make Garen somebody else, probably. I don't think I will run this too much longer. Man, I really want, like, a Bloodthirster and a Titan's Resolve on her. Or on him, I guess. On both of them. They're a mech pilot. Oh, dude, I could actually absorb two units, too. I totally forgot I could absorb two units. Once I get the second version of this trait. Which is coming up pretty soon here. Hmm. <laughs> Dude, these boards that you can make are so cool, man. I've been having so much fun in this game mode. I like it a lot. An encounter. There's so much stuff going on. I love it. Um, six artifacts. Wits end. Unending despair. It's just... Manazine. That's hilarious. I'm gonna do that. Ooh, Trinity Force. Sure. Uh, wit's end? Who do I... Where's my golden remover? There it is. Oh, I can't take that off yet. Okay. Um, Maj. Oh, dude. Didn't get to do it in time. Just fumbling around with all these items that I have. Hopefully this is good enough. Let's see if he can ult from far away with this rapid fire. Ooh, this guy's tanky. Oh yeah, he totally can ult from far away. That's hilarious. I guess that's completely viable if I find uh, an actual rapid fire. Get him. Get him! No. I mean, he's healing quite a bit. I don't even know at this point. Now he'll definitely get got by my Jaina, right? Dude. <laughs> Why can he do that? He can just infinitely build forever. Build infinite stacks and HP forever and ever. I need that sword and that Soraka right there. Oh, okay. Okay, thought he was gonna get it there. If not a bow, but there is no bow. So yeah, the Soraka is definitely gonna be my bow. Oh, she's gone. <laughs> That's disappointing. Uh, belt. Oh man, Riven's gone as well. I'll just get Belt. Whatever. Whatever, dude. I'm about to get a level 2 mech. I don't even care. Let's go. Yes, level 2 mech pilot. Oh, dude. It uh, absorbs quite a few units here. So I would be down a few. Maybe I could do like a... do like a war mogs on her I don't know who to absorb I kind of want to try absorbing that um oh dude Kane I mean what how would I even fit Kane in this team would he be a good replacement for Riven I have no idea look he kind of has a lot of HP when he absorbs two targets uh, maybe Reaper. If I could get Reaper active somehow. Okay, dude. 
Okay, dude. Oh, <laughs> that uh, ult is pretty hilarious, actually. That's so cool. I love that so much. Felios calls down two components. Dude, give me bows. Or a sword. This is necessary. Okay, so there's my sword that I wanted. What about a bow? Yes, dude. Okay, this is not bad. Oh, this gives me a reaper, though. Gives me a reaper. And then... I guess this. Okay, I hope that works out here. We will find out soon enough whether that is worth it or not. I think it might be. Those are really good items on him, if anything. He's healing quite a bit, and he definitely has Reaper active at the moment, so... I think what he needs, though, is probably another Titan's Resolve for, for his own sake of having those items on him. And I definitely got a two-star cane because I'm pretty sure it's very reliant on, like, what level the unit is. Oh, okay. All right. That's that's awesome. Now it's going to absorb that two-star Diana as well. I need more heavenly units, though. I really need... Okay, I need to put Kiana in somewhere. I don't want to take Sage out. Probably want this for even more AD. Then uh, I just go level 8, I suppose, to try to get a 2-star cane and put Kiana in there. That's awesome. Uh, now I just need a vest. Vest. No vest. No vest is unfortunate. Okay. It's a Dragon Lord, or I could put Heavenly. Maybe Dragon Lord, though. Dragon Lord seems like kind of a neat pool to put to put in there. Dragon Lord and where's my I dude? I keep losing track of my infinite item remover. It's uh, making me very dizzy. Dang, I really need to go level nine, really. Oh, that guy opted out for putting a bunch of chain vests on his Garen. I guess he's using him as a tank, as a mecha tank, and it's, dude, it's working out really well, actually. He's tanking. Hell, oh. Well, once uh, Garen targeted his backline, it was kind of over. <laughs> That's crazy. Okay, I think I could stay at two Reaper and then just get, like, either more Dragon Lord, like a Rakan, so I could get the stun, or more Heavenly. It's a Dragon Lord crest. Yeah, I guess I'll take this. And a Wukong. Now that's pretty good, man. That is pretty strong right there. Um, guess I'll put the Dragonlord Crest on. Just here for now. And then what do I do? I'm not even sure. I'm not even sure. I don't know if I should absorb Kha'Zix. I think I should absorb this to give me even more HP. Now I just got a two-star, my dude. Dude, I almost have a three-star, uh... Three-star chick right there. I'm very close to three-star Diana. And I've somehow managed to fit in three Sage. I could lose out on one Sage, though, so I could get just a little bit more of the Heavenly bonus. I think I will end up doing that. Because even though Sage is quite good, the Heavenly bonus is just going to pay off a lot more. I suppose if I get a... Uh, it's mandatory if I get a Heavenly Spat, for sure, but... I don't have the Heavenly Spat yet. This guy does, though. Okay, I'm, I'm probably going to keep rolling down every round until I hit a 2-star Kane and a 3-star Diana. 3-star Diana would be so sick to have right now. That would definitely be amazing. Another Wukong. I want to slam some more items here, but I'm not sure what to slam. I think I could definitely slam some items here on Wukong. Just really going to need, like, a DPS item. Whoops, I did not mean to use that bow. I forgot I was trying to make another Titan's Resolve. 
I really forgot. But I think Garen would really, really want uh, another Titans. My board's looking pretty strong at the moment. Now I almost have a three-star Diana. I wonder what third item I should put on her. Rakan would be sweet. He would be really, really good. He would give me four Dragon Lord, which would be insane. My Garen would uh, definitely have some time to himself. Bow would be good. Vest would be good. There is no vest. I see the bow, though. The bow would be pretty nice. Come on, let me get that bow, bro. Let me get that bow. Bow, bow, bow. Did you guys ever watch that show? Bow, 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 bow. It was a great show. I used to love it. Do you start Wukong? Do you start Wukong? I'll take that. Hmm. Should I get another ghostly unit? Some yeah, I think. Shall I, prove I think that right? would be even better. And there's a Soraka. Am I going to be able to fit all these units in, though? I don't think I am. I can build the Nasher's Tooth, but I, I really am waiting for that uh, other Titan's Resolve. No two-star... No two-star Kane, though, and I really... really kind of need him to be two-star so Garen can be even bigger. There's my other Kane. Hmm... What do I get rid of here? Malphite? Nico? Get rid of Malphite for now. I'm coming for you. Another Diana. Get rid of Nico, I guess. I guess Soraka would have been the right choice to get rid of, but. I am only one more Diana away from from three-starring her and feeding her to the Mecha Garen. That would be pretty good. Oh. Come on. It has, dude. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. I forgot they all hop out once they're done. That's pretty great. <laughs> That's glorious. I love that so much. Guess I just... Um, yeah, I can't chill. I have no chill, man. Another Lee Sin. Maybe Lee Sin will be the ultimate mecha pilot. I need to start saving gold so I can level up, though. Oh, dude, I can actually... Dude, I should put Wukong in the mecha pilot. I forgot that they hop out eventually, so... It's not, like, the worst thing in the world if I have them in there for a little bit. Do you start Kane? Do you start Kane? Tra chain vest? Yes. Chain vest. Golden remover. And there you go. Okay, now I have a Hajj. I could do that. Rageblade or Nasher's Tooth? Do Rageblade. And then some health. I'll just put that on her for now so she could just give the Mecha Garen more HP. <laughs> dude, that Mecha Garen. Mecha Garen is huge, dude. I don't think I should roll down anymore. I think I should just try to go level 9, I think. Oh! Wow, this guy actually beat the Mecha Garen, man. It's the guy going what I'm going. I don't like that. He got the Heavenly Spat on the cane. So, yeah, I'm definitely never going to hit the cane. It's just not going to happen. I'm not going to roll down. I'm just going to wait till I can go level 9. Hopefully I get really lucky and am able to 3-star my Diana without rolling down. It's not like this guy has Diana. To 100 HP. Dude, if... I mean, can he set Mecha Garen's health to 100 HP? That would be pretty broken. Come on, build up the stacks, boy. Build up those stacks, boy. Yes, that attack speed is so good. Dude, he's just... You guys see him swinging his sword, just taking people out? <laughs> I mean, if I three-star Lee Sin, I'll definitely put him in. We'll see about that, though. Yeah, three-starring Jaina would be pretty good as well. That and uh, Diana, of course. The Diana would be a huge, huge improvement. I only need one more. So hopefully I find her soon. 
he's doing a lot of damage though. That Mecha Garen is awesome. Uh, what do I need here? Probably get that Hodge for my Lee Sin. That Hodge for my Lee Sin would be good. The Spear of Shojin for my Jaina. There's no Jaina there though. Yeah, I think I'll take Spear. Spear of Shojin. I'm really counting on three starring my my dude, my Jaina and my Diana, but oh, I didn't mean to buy that. I'll do that though. Dude, I need another Diana. That's what I really need. This guy's level seven. He's going level eight. This guy's level eight going on level nine. It's the one playing heavenly. Yeah. This guy is level eight going on level nine as well. This guy's level six. There's a lot of people going heavenly in here. It's me and a whole bunch of other people. Dude, this guy's gonna get me for sure. Oh man, Kane's gotta transform. Uh, maybe? Oh, I can't believe it. The Bloodthirster saved his life so badly. Dude, maybe I should go for, like, these items on Wukong. And then make Wukong the pilot. Would that be better, you think? If I put Wukong as the pilot? I mean, Last Whisper and Guardbreaker actually would work with the Mecha Garen. I don't know. It's a tough choice. Oh, this is the guy with, like, the insane cane that has the heavenly bonus. Come on, bro, that's unfair. He's so strong. Uh, maybe Garen can AoE them all? Oh, he's definitely trying. What is that? Is that the Glacial Mallet? Is that... It must have been... The... Dude, that's crazy, man. He melted me. He really, really melted me. It's not an insane win streak. He's so strong. Bilgewater. 130 plus 35% damage cell. Every 20th cannon wall is replaced with a treasure chest that drops gold. That's hilarious. Okay, it's just the 7 Heavenly 4 Reaper. How am I going to beat that? I'm sure I can beat it. But I need to go level 9 and get it a little lucky here. And some some 3 stars. And an item. Okay, level 9. There's that, which I really needed. There's also that, which I welcome greatly. Another heavenly. Okay, so I think for now, a bloodthirster. Bloodthirster here. Okay, well, now I get to absorb two three-star units, so my Garen's even bigger. Hopefully that means he is a lot stronger. I just need a three-star anything, really. Oh, not this guy. This guy's like immortal. This guy's like freaking immortal, man. Somebody go get his backline. For the love. Aw, oh, dude. Come on. Gotta get his backline, dude. Four-star Morgana. What was that? Oh, I rolled over Kane. Who am I fighting next? Nomzy. It's Nomzy boy. Okay, I think that I might benefit from doing like that. Oh, I didn't get to put Guard Breaker on Kane. I think this is genuinely better, though. Um, just because he scales with Heavenly as well. And that, that just might be better. And then I need one more item to put on my... Uh... Oh, wow. Dude. Didn't even matter at all there. I got absolutely washed. 
Okay, uh, maybe the Scarred Breaker on him. I mean, those are all really good cane items, man. Maybe I just want to, like, absorb some... No, no, I want to have, like, a bunch of HP. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that and absorb as many stats as I possibly can. Uh, yeah, like, having him back there is fine. Because... He's just gonna, like, walk through once they get absorbed. Oh, I think... I think it actually absorbed the cane and it wasn't really supposed to. Supposed to absorb... Not cane. The Diana for HP. Oh, wow. Is this the right play? Go, go, go. Go get her. Nice, dude. Okay, we still have a very good fighting chance there. It's kind of awesome that it absorbed the cane there. Hmm. There's a spatula, but what are the chances I actually get what I need? I guess I'll take this. Spatula would be kind of silly, just because, like, there's no way that I can guarantee getting a cloak from the crab. So I just took Aurelia. And now I have a Hajj. And I guess I put the Hajj right here. I think I think swallowing those two units right there is going to be the best bet. Man, I really don't know what... You know what? Yes, I do. I'll just put the Guard Breaker right there. But if it absorbs all the stats, then I probably want the Hajj on Diana there. Just so Garen can benefit from it. Oh, this guy's front line is so crazy. It's so crazy, bro. They're struggling. Struggling to get through that. Oh, this, might, this guy might get me. I don't know. I think... I think maybe I just can't have my main units be uh, swallowed up like that. Maybe that's what it is. Oh, I find... <laughs> I got a spatula. That's crazy. I don't know what to build. Um, let me just think about who I'm going to have it absorb for a second. I'm going to have it absorb... Um... This and I guess like a dryad spat doesn't really matter. I don't think I can play a dryad right now. Uh oh. Oh come on, get get that guy, bro. That guy's a menace. <laughs> Go please. Oh no. Oh, it's close. I think I can roll down here for maybe a three star. Some call me evil. Shall I prove them right? One three star or other. Maybe having him absorb Kane isn't such a bad idea. Or like these two dudes. There we go. Something like this, I guess. Wouldn't be too bad. It's hard to decide who to... I mean, that looks good, actually. He looks huge that way. Okay. Time to roll down. Okay. Morgana? Morgana it is. Three star Morgana. It's not bad. And I'll just put red buff on Kane so that he has something to use. Alright, hopefully that's enough. This guy is insanely strong, so maybe it won't be, but... Uh, three star Morgana should help me melt some of these insane front lines that I've been fighting. Okay. 
All right. Oh, and it's a first. If you enjoyed that, make sure you like and subscribe. I will see you on the next one. GG.